Hello and welcome back to Shadow of the Tomb Raider in the last part. We got into some pretty deep shit and uh, our, our true hero, Green Arrow, unfortunately ate shit and died. So uh, we're going to have to avenge them very hard in this level. This level? Hello? This Hello, session? Uh, who is this? I've suspected you've been monitoring my communication since Mexico. Who's that, Rock? Yeah. Rock. Commander Rourke. Oh, I'm sorry, big boy. And now, I'm listening to you. Another foreshock. How's it feel, knowing you're responsible for all these cataclysms? All that suffering. Uh, it feels pretty bad, I'm not I gonna lie. I did. The look on your face when Dominguez told you. But you just had to have that dagger, didn't you? It was pretty shiny. Forward outpost. Croft is moving oh. into your did that cancel the fucking dialogue? At the beach. It can't happen again. Man, if they're gonna start that dialogue by, like, there starting goggles, it when you gentlemen. walk forward down one. that, like, one long, long tunnel bit, then they should at least make the tunnel long enough so that you can't cut off the dialogue. Because I would have loved to know how that was gonna end. Enemies equipped with thermal goggles can detect lava through vegetation, but not through walls. Oh. Shit. False positive. Oh. <laughs> hey, are we getting those lights up or what? I'm never gonna get them more. Well, keep pestering me. Nice thermal Damn goggles, prick. Rourke said Croft's coming through here. God damn it. Alright, I'm hurrying. Okay, let's have some of that. This is not the Where am I actually? I am headed over there, okay. Well, let's just go all sneaky around the side, shall we? See what there is to see. When I find you, you're dead. Hold RB to craft a shrapnel grenade. I mean, we'll see how smart. It'd be rude to say no. Technically, they're not alerted yet, so I still can't pull my bow out. <laughs> Which is strange. Hmm. Come on, come around here. Come around here, you fucker. Very stealthy. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Wait, I still can't pull out my guns. Uh, why can't I pull out my guns? No shame in giving up. Well, I ge genuinely... I genuinely it. can't pull out my guns. This is definitely a bug. Why is this game so fucking buggy? I swear to Christ. Why can't I... Oh, no, I lost them all, didn't I? Or... Is she... She's carrying some shit. But no. No, I think it's... I can't tell. It looks like she's got a pistol on her hip, though. Hmm. We're going to work under the assumption that I can't pull them out because I lost them. Not that this is bugged. For now. All full up. God damn it, people, use the goggles. Find her. With the use of mud, she can negate the effect of thermal vision. Hooray. See anyone? If I did, I'd be shooting. Yeah, Dumbo. Oh, that's a fair amount of people. Okay, then. Okay, then. Where'd he go? Hmm. What the? Oh, fuck. Oh, I forgot I got the combo. 
I got the combo one, didn't I? Haha! -ha. That was all planned. I am just the fucking stealth machine out here. We've got to stop her. Don't worry, we will. Yeah? You that sure of the new equipment? No, but I'm sure of Rourke. I mean, oh, there we go. I was going to say, how the fuck is he not? Oh, never mind. We can get him too. <laughs> Just another day. She won't get through here. And either the chopper or the search team will crush her friend. About time. Don't know why we can just get the double whammy soon. here as well, can't we? There we go. Man, this fucking combo takedown is incredible. Absolute yes to this. Let me loot all your shit. Very nice, tasty stuff. Okay. Onwards. Never in doubt, I heard. Right. What will be next for our intrepid heroine? Uh, some strong controller vibration. Are you okay? Was that the earthquake? I'm near an oil refinery. Everything's blowing up. Oh, shit. We're in cutscene. I can't do anything. They're listening. Uh, still can't. There we go. Damn. Okay, let's go infiltrate a fucking oil refinery. Not gonna lie, I wasn't really expecting to see that out here. But, uh, ain't gonna complain about it either. Cheeky. What have we got here? Oh, it's our bow. Feels good. <laughs> Glad there's another bow just left down here. It's a recipe for a hallucinogen, sometimes used in war. Add mushrooms to mushrooms. That's the recipe. Hooray! <laughs> this should help. No way, really. Your fucking most useful weapon if I use this on my arrows, might help. It could be an advantage against Trinity. Do you want to say that in a more plot expositionary way? If I use these on my arrows, it could be an advantage against Trinity. Fear arrows cause enemies to attack their allies. Craft with silent arrows, cloth, and dart poison. Don't think I have any dart poison. Hello. Give me your lore stuff. This must be Mama Zara. <laughs> I always thought her forms of worship were a fun tradition. Why is that? She was the Incan goddess of grain, and her name means maize mother. So if ever a farmer found a strange maize plant, they would dress it up like a doll in honor of her. Okay, she was that's a bit strange. <laughs> so sometimes the farming communities would hang one of their maize dolls from a willow tree and dance around it for her. Interesting. Also, 80% getting nearer to finishing that one off. Or finishing part two of that one off. It looks like the third one, which... Trinity I mean, this one's being fucking slow enough. So. And as for the Pytetian Emperor... That's going to take a while. He can truly understand just what this box is. But I do. And I know it should not be used by just anyone. That would be catastrophic. Only the purest among us should make the decision as to how to wield the power of the silver box... That is why I must hide it. I feel like not even the purest among us. Like, just get rid of the fucking thing. <laughs> I'm very interested to see what this, um, like, we were told it would tempt us. I'm very interested to see how that plays out. Ooh, what that looks up. like Can't in practice. Tau team, Croft is on a vector toward your position. I say again, Croft is coming to you. Jesus Christ. <laughs> we'll get her, sir. Show me her corpse, and your entire team is next in line for deacon training. Huh. While aiming, press RB to shoot an enemy with a fear arrow. Let's do this. Does it? Oh, and then he chokes out. 
Jesus. Oh, that is interesting. Nice. I think that's everyone in this area. Very smooth. Smooth as a baby's ass, as the saying goes. Base camp's having trouble receiving me. As soon as this is up, we'll use it to boost your signal. How about more lights? Once the radio's done. Okay, is there any way to, um... Oh, hello. Yes, I will land up here. Very nice. The problem isn't the generator for a change. Can I jump over here? Let's find out. Nice. I can. Okay. She's got you. Fear arrow. How many of these do I have? I only have two more. Okay. <laughs> it's useful. Counts as stealth kills too. Very nice. Very nice. Looks like they only kill one person. Uh, it seems like they kill one person fairly quickly and then they kill themselves. I'm going to need to discover how to fucking craft more of these because this is amazing. <laughs> this is overpowered as hell <laughs> from what I can tell so far. Hello! <laughs> ah, get shotgun! Oh my god. That's incredible. Truly. Truly, that is incredible. Okay, I'm out of them, so. Yeah, it looks like I can't make any more. Which is unfortunate. Okay, let's see if he heads over nearer towards me so I can string him up. Yeah, very nice. Very, very nice. Doing all this from one tree. Overpowered or what, hey? Okay. I don't actually know, because I'm pretty sure I saw someone like head round this way, didn't I? Okay, I can climb up over there. I'm trying to see what paths I can take. But let's wait for this guy. You do. You really do need to get to the bottom of this. Okay, can I hang... No, I can't hang them up, but once I've already hung someone up, I can't hang someone else up. But you know what? That's fine. Gotta do a sweep. Okay, come on. Round the corner you go. Come on, come on. There we go. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> I would love to know how many more people there are. I really should get the um, automatic... Uh, automatic loot body perk. That would be helpful. Okay, are there any more? Up here, perhaps? No. Up. Can't carry any more. Hmm. Where am I actually heading? Over this way? All full up. Can't carry any more. Okay, can anyone spot anyone else? <laughs> I think we might be good. Okay, onwards then. I 
I think that's the first time I've done a combat thing without ever being spotted. I think, which is pretty cool. Jonah? Jonah, come in, please. He's not gonna answer, Lara. What? He's dead. Now you can add your friend Jonah to the list of people you've gotten killed. I doubt that's true. I doubt Fuck that is true you, very Hulk. much. If you want to pick up his body, it's at the refinery. There's no way they kill off Jonah like that. For you. There's no way. Dominguez forbade us from mingling with the locals. Didn't want us corrupting them. Luckily, one of the priests developed a taste for bourbon. And as long as I brought a pint with me, he'd lend me his costume, mask and all. <laughs> Walking through the lower city was like traveling 500 years into the past. Seems like a decent trade, if you're into that kind of thing. <laughs> a little bit of dress up, ooh. Can I not muddy myself here? Seems like a muddy myself area. Okay, we're going fucking straight into the guts of this place. Very interesting. Uh-oh. 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 Lara, maybe the front gate wasn't the best entrance. But I didn't I feel like you didn't react fast enough right there. Oh my god. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, we've got a running sequence. Sequence. Oh, climb, climb, climb. Fuck. <laughs> Around. <laughs> Around we go. Oh my god, this is awesome. This is very, very, very cool. I feel like you could get a bit of a, a bit of a shift on though, Lara. You're not exactly moving at your ultimate pace here. Is this where I'm going? Oh yep. Yeah. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Lara, please. <laughs> this is so sick. Oh, this is the best one of these they've done, I think. Oh my god, this is amazing. Come on, come on, girl. These guys better all lose their fucking jobs at the end of this. Like, how have you not hit me yet? I really am not sure. Oh my. Jesus. This is so pretty. This is beautiful. Oh, fuck. Oh, thank God there was water there. Otherwise, fucking rest in peace, my spine. I have to keep going, and if I don't, then I'll just let everyone down. Any catastrophes you're doing. I have to go. I'm the only one. You're the only one that can work. Oh, oh, I like that. Oh, I like that. Oh my god. Oh, that looks badass as hell. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god, I just got a little bit of the little bit of the chills. Oh, I'll take a fucking drum gun. Yes, please. Okay, I'm not sure about just standing still getting shot at. That seems less sensible. God damn though. Oh, that destructible environment. Damn. You are fucking dead. This is Rourke. Oh my god. Winters, Croft is all yours. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Base camp, this is Cardinal 2. Oh, I'm looking out for this. That's a solid family favourite there. Woo! Come on. Did he die? Okay. I didn't, 
I am reloading. You are correct. Oh, yes, I will take some ammo. Thank you very much. Hello. Goodbye. I'll have some more ammo. Okay, where am I heading to? I'm not actually sure. Oh, I'm, oh, there's more people that need to know this. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. Lovely stuff. Some more for you over there. Okay. Good night, Vienna. He's burning to death. Oh, and the uh, chopper just fucking. Okay. I'm not sure what happened there. Rest in peace, the chopper, apparently. Well, I think this may have been the coolest section of any Tomb Raider game ever made in the history of the world and the universe ever. Fuck me. Hey, called it. That boy is alive. But Jonah, I just massacred so many people. <laughs> hey, are you okay? Yeah. Pretty glad I got my gun training in. Making everything work. <laughs> you're not. Hey, you're not. I mean, I did set off the apocalypse. That did is just this? a fact. <sighs> Come on. Where to next? Can't stay here. I don't know, Jonah! <laughs> I'm very surprised they didn't execute him clue? when they uh, uh, figured out I was the serpent, on my something. way. The heart of the serpent is in the cup, near the many stone faces. And what kind of cup are we talking about? Some kind of chalice? A chalice that's not very Mayan. Wait. Are we having a light bulb moment? Lara loves the light bulb moment. I don't it's know! Oh, I figured it out. The clue was left by a 17th century missionary, Andrea Lopez, a Jesuit. The serpent in the chalice is a symbol of St. John. We're looking for a Christian holy site. Like a church of San Juan? That's a pretty common name. It could be dozens. <sighs> Not within trekking distance from Paititi. <sighs> Come on. The road is this way. We'll get out of here, talk to some people. Okay. What would I do without you? Probably massacre some more people. I kind of do expect Jonah to die. I just expect it to be on screen, not... Oh yeah, he's dead, by the way. I do kind of feel like they would kill him off, because obviously... He's not a character that was ever in the games before, or at least I'd never heard of him. I've not played the old Tomb Raiders. I mean, maybe he was a character that was in the other games before, but I'm working under the assumption that he wasn't, and therefore, he dies. Mission of San Juan, Peru. This is it, Church of San Juan. Let's split up. I'll look for signs of Lopez. We'll ask around, see what we can find out. My friend Sara's an archaeologist. She works near here. You want to go see if she knows anything about your riddle? I that sure do. Right. The stone faces have always been Sara's obsession. 
Most people come here looking for treasure, but not Sara. Did you just, just wants answers. forget where you were going? Since we were kids. She was the nerd, I was always skipping school and stealing my grandma's RV. Once in a while, I could convince Sara to come with me. Usually if some kind of ruins were involved. Uh, game please. Those were the best times. I have a feeling she and I will get along. Right, are you gonna take me to this place now? Okay. Sure <laughs> that was strange. Abby, can you help me with this? It's broken. Hello, I'll help. Hold on. Are you that ladder? My Cross? god, my legend is spreading. I, I recognize you from your picture. What's your interest with this place? I'm following a riddle. The heart of the serpent is in the cup near the many stone faces. The stone faces. That's why I'm here too. I don't wow. want to step on your toes. We have so it's much in the common. In the cup I'm really looking for. Well, I can tell you the faces have been here for at least four hundred years. According to documents in the library, they keep watch. Legend has it, they're guarding a secret crypt. A crypt? I We've wonder what that could be. It. As you can imagine, that's what drives the treasure hunters crazy. Now watch me but find it in the next, like, is as clever hour. As she is, <laughs> well, if you were to find it, you might be doing me a favor. You think I should start at the library? Yes, it's over by the cemetery. It's one of the oldest buildings here. Make sure you credit me if you find anything. Thank you. I will. Sure. Top of my priority list, that. Hello, Mr. Mission Giver. Did you say someone's missing? Yes, Isabella. Another member of the field study. I checked on her after the first tremors this morning, but her tent was empty. Ah. You should ask Manu. Probably, probably dead. probably told her where to find El Dorado. This is serious. We had a fight last night. A bad one. I'm sorry, Guillermo. I didn't realize. Please continue. You had a fight. I don't mean to pry, but... It's all right. We've been very close friends for almost a year, and I think both of us would like there to be more... Neither of us has broached the subject. Lisa and Sarah, they often don't get along. Sorry, Sarah, but it's true. Because Sarah insists on her team being very down to earth, while Isa has a passion for folkloric tales of hidden temples. I often get caught in the middle. Interesting passion. Those Me, I have a passion for gaming. Somewhere. Not a passion for historic up. folklore temples, whatever the fuck you just said. That's Isa's viewpoint too. Anyway, there's an old blind man who lives here named Manu who's full of these kinds of stories. He convinced her there's a secret crypt hidden around here, and last night she asked me to come with her and find it. I refused, and we got into the old fight. It ended with her calling me a hidebound coward, and me calling her a... A hidebound a coward? Child. What the so fuck is off. that insult? Yes. Apart from shit. To as she put it, prove all you naysayers wrong. This morning I heard rumors that she vandalized the cemetery last night. That's when I started looking for her. When I found her missing with no one knowing anything, I started to worry. What if she went looking for the crypt and something happened? I could like she myself. died. Man, you really should have started that relationship. You stay here. You'll so regret that for the rest news, of your life. If she comes back, you'll know about it. I'll go looking for Isabella, starting with the cemetery. You do that? To be honest, I'm as curious about that crypt as she is. Yeah, not gonna lie, the crypt is my primary focus, but oh, if I happen to run into you, your fucking you girlfriend. Time, Wait, why has he still got this over his head? It's not about that. Oh, okay. I've been here five Abby's minutes, Jonah. The the I'll meet you there. Prick. <laughs> Give me a fucking minute here. Jesus. What have you got to say for yourself? My father brought us here when I was just a boy. Very interesting, friend. Best of luck with your life. Oh my god, the subtitles follow me everywhere. <laughs> I want a bonfire. Uh, okay. Was that because I talked to the guy? Maybe. I can't quite explain it, but have you noticed how the world seems thinner here than in other places? Nope, can't say I have. There must be a fucking bonfire somewhere around here, surely. And then we will ring the two bells to progress. Oh my god, actually, okay. Do you want to give me some fucking hints? It seems like every few years. Miriaki. 
Hello. Interesting. Thirtieth of December, sixteen oh three. Lopez has just returned from a nearby village, and with him came a group he says will follow him and help us with construction. There was something strange about his behavior. I attributed it to the long journey through the jungle. That night, however, he admitted what had been bothering him. They followed me, he whispered. The others. He walked off. I spent that sleepless night worrying about his deviations toward madness. Ooh, spoopy ghost. Dude has become a nut job. Feels bad. Right, didn't it say over here somewhere was a thing? I could have sworn. Oh, over here. Oh, and there's a document behind me. Here somewhere? To my left. Uh, no, Lara. <laughs> no, Lara. Where's this fucking document then, hey? Oh, right in front of me? Ah! This Spanish document is fascinating. It tells the story of several natural disasters which struck this area. A flood, a fire caused by lightning, and a severe volcanic tremor. In each instance, buildings on this site were badly damaged, requiring considerable rebuilding. Rest in pepperoni. Okay, I guess there isn't a fucking bonfire around here. I kind of want to explore what's down the end. So there's a crypt around oh, here hello. A secret crypt. Why secret? I guess this was the way to go, never mind. <laughs> there's bound to be a trick. That's a solid theory. What about you? Did you find anything? I got a pamphlet. Seven steps closer to God. Wow, you're really helping the team <laughs> out here. Maybe it'll help. Strange, there are only seven stations. This must be based on an older tradition. Jesus takes up the cross, falls the first time, meets his mother. Then Veronica wipes his face before he falls the second time. Then he is crucified and finally entombed. Not a not the best life. Has to be said. Someone once said if you really want to learn about a town, you have to visit their graveyard. I bet that someone was really fun at parties. Calling me a witch. <laughs> Imagine. You witch? I'm sorry. I'm a herbalist, a shamefully unrecognized branch of medical science. And that child's grandmother was a dowser. The things people ignore that are right in front of their noses. My thoughts Some exactly. Are afraid to believe in what they can't understand. Ha! Huh, you sound like Isa. Isabella, the archaeologist. You know her. A smart girl. A good researcher, and unafraid to admit there are things she doesn't know. She's the one who broke the cross. By climbing on it. I don't know what was in her head. I tried to stop her, but she was very upset about something. Angry and full of grief at the same time. Do you know where she is now? I'm looking for her. I don't know. After the cross broke, she ran away, but I didn't see which direction. In the state she was in, I knew better than to try to interfere with her. I'm sorry. Well, that's no that's use to me. That's right. You've given me more information than I had. 
Do you need some help with this cross? I do. But first, we have to get those children out of the way. It isn't safe for them to be running around while we work. That blind trickster filled their heads with tales of treasure, and they think I mean to steal it. Because you're a witch. I'll talk to them. Hey. Hey, kids, fuck off. Hey, get away from here. It's our treasure. It's getting quite late. How about postponing the hunt until tomorrow? No, we're not leaving till we find it. We'll sleep here if we have to. Oh, I hope it doesn't come to that. Is there anything I can do to help? No, we told you. You're not getting our treasure. I've gotten into a real bad no, habit lately of murdering everyone who doesn't do what I say, so uh, you might want to just leave. Shame. The sisters told me you were very good at sharing, and I do know a lot about treasure hunting. You know the sisters? She could tell on us. I won't tell if you won't tell. I have a secret too. I'm the brave adventurer Lara Croft. Whoa. Wow. Tell. You can help us. If you find the treasure, we'll split it even. If I find the treasure, I'll keep it. What do you even? Manu told us we need to solve a riddle to find the treasure. Are you any good at riddles? I'm, oh, I'm the expert. fucking best. Let's hear it. I've wanted to take my supply. I'm nourished when the heavens cry. If I get sick, a village dies. Who, Who am, am I? I? Soil? I feel like that was soil. Nourished when the heavens cry. If I get sick, the village dies because it can't grow grain anymore. Oh, okay, that's a lot of fucking documents just appeared. Jesus. Right. Yes, I agree. <coughs> well, this is a fucking dusty old place, eh? Like a mausoleum. Mm, means we're on the right track, right? Jonah, I feel something. We're getting close. Let's look around for signs of Lopez. Man, I've got all these skill points and I can't for the life of me find a fucking bonfire. They're talking about funds allocated for renovations to the library. I feel like there has to be one around here somewhere. Hello. Okay. I need, I really want to fucking upgrade some shit, so I'm going to go and have another look, and uh, I'll cut out that having a look, uh, just for you, so I'll BRB. Oh, hooray, okay, so it's just down here, uh, this is where we got the side quest, these guys at the tree. Happy days. That took literally one minute to find. And uh, the skill points. How many are there? He makes I have four. So I probably would have walked here to the mission, but Jonah, he just asked Abby for a ride and she said yes. I hope we're in the right place and we can find the box before Trinity. The earthquake hit last night at the oil facility, and now there's a volcano. Is this where the next cataclysm will hit? We have to end this before this town ends up like Cozumel. I can't for the fucking life of me see this auto uh, loot one. Where the fuck is it? Am I being blind? Ah. There we go. Very nice. And aside from that, uh, fear our effects last longer, sure. Oh, and that's all the skill points. Okay, what about upgrades? Oh, hang on. 
Do we not get the recurve bow back? I mean, this is looking like a lot of fucking stuff to put into a new bow when I've already maxed out the old one. But sure. Damn it. These both require fucking four, these final upgrades. Loads arrows faster. Increased hold time I don't care about. Let's go with that. Okay, can't do the last one. And then down here. A new assault rifle. Let's whap up the damage. Increased rate of fire, faster reloading, larger magazine. I mean, stability is probably the best anyway. Hmm. Let's have a bit of that. A little bit of that. Do I have to make a choice here? I don't. Hooray. Just max it out. <laughs> Hooray. Wow. It's a good thing I fucking hoard like a motherfucker, hey? Uh, we can boost this up. My god, this is just fucking... Oh man, that needs eight. <laughs> Gun crafting time. With your host, Living Sun. Why not, eh? Why not? Lovely. Lovely stuff. And on that happy note, we will end this part. In the next part, we'll head back to the library, see what we can see, and, uh, yeah, make some real progress. I only had a short amount of time tonight, but, uh, next time. Next time, I may even finish the game. I think I've got, I think I've got it in me to just sit down and, uh, play through at the weekend. So I'm very excited for that. If you are too, please leave a like and subscribe. Share the video around if you can. I would really appreciate that and hope to see you again next time for more. Thanks for watching.